Rose here, and this is the Wizarding World crate. <clears throat> it has finally arrived. This is crate number 32, I think. Either 31 or 32. Um, it'll say in the title anyway. And this is um, the January 2020 box. So it's it's been a while coming. <laughs> and uh, this was the sticker that was on it. I, I still say they should include one of these unstuck, you know, so we can keep them. So I don't have to always have to be careful of the not ripping it. Anyway, so. Ta-da! So it's. Here's your peak. <laughs> Whether you can really see. And this is. The background. You've got Harry's glasses, his wand, and Hedwig. If it's supposed to be Hedwig, and loads of little stars and circles, which could be snow. You never know these days. Okay, so um, I'll move this off to the side so I have space to show. And just put it over here. Hopefully, it will not fall. Okay, so. First item, Ooh. we have Hogwarts House striped socks. Very nice. They're 97% uh, polyester, 3% spandex, machine wash cold. Well, you don't really need to know all this. All right, is size 6 to 12. That looks it. Very nice. And it is this exact same <coughs> design as what's on the back of the box. It's got a little trademark and copyright WB thing on the inside as well. I mean, technically you can really do without that, but anyway. So we got socks. It's nice. So, I'll put this back further. Maybe if I put it down a bit. There. So, I'll just prop that up there. I don't know if I put any back further, it'll probably fall off the desk. So. We'll go like that. And considering I am not looking at the camera, I do not know if I'll be in focus. Hopefully I'll be in frame. Ooh, it's a shirt. No? Yes, it's a shirt. And it is a quidditch. There is nothing on the back. But it's, it says Hogwarts. Kind of like sort of gold, glittery. <clears throat> Let me just lay this down here. I'll move the camera so you can see it better. There. So you got Snitch, Beater's Bat, Quaffle, Gold Posts, and I guess Nimbus 2000. It's got Quidditch. EST 1092. So this one, since I, in general, do not care about sports whatsoever, this will go on my eBay, because I don't, you know, do anything about sports. So I just fold it back up. Oh, I, I can fold it better afterwards. Okay. Alright, so there's the shirt. I'll put it on this side so it doesn't get in the way. Um, okay, so.
It says uh, School of Woodcraft and Wizardry, Hogwarts. Oh, it goes this way. And it is a. Uh, it's got a Velcro bit here to roll it out. Though, there is no cheat sheet. For some odd reason. Which is unfortunate. That would have been really helpful. Anyway, well, it's supposed to be magical creatures for the uh, theme. Possibly. I don't know anymore. One second, let me just check. I don't know. I think it is magical creatures. I'll just be going down the list if they're sending them in order. Anyway, um, so this, I don't know what it is, so I'll have to open it and see. I think it's like some type of mat or picnic thing, or it's a blanket. Well, I guess we'll see in it. So this is that type of fabric on this side, and it's more of like cotton on or something, softer material on the inside. My guess it's a picnic blanket, I think if that's what it's supposed to be. And it's got all sorts of designs on the inside. Here's glasses, time turner, and a chocolate frog. Oh, that looks pretty chubby, doesn't it? So that and um, uh, potion vials as well. Sorting hat. It's possible that is a bizarre thing. We've got a Hogwarts crest in there. I don't really want to open it all the way because then it'll be a hassle trying to get it back in. So I vaguely remember there being one. I was either called a picnic blanket or a travel mat or something. But it is a decent size. So I need to really roll it myself. Oh, try not to knock everything over. Well, that will do. It's got little 
nice that it has a little um, handle. Yes, that's the word. Okay, so there is that and that. I really need to fix this stuff. Okay, so we have this thing. Well, on it, it says... Dobby storage tins. So let's have a look and see what it looks like. Well, that's cute. That, well, it's got Hogwarts School and Witchcraft and Misery on the top. It's got loads of little stars and I guess snow as well. 2020. Copyright, made in China. For some reason, got a bit of a scuff mark down there, I think. Where that's supposed to be there, but I think that's not. But anyway, it's on the back. And this is the front. Isn't that so cute? Cute Dobby. So cute. So then, just like a tin, and you can tell this is um, kind of uh, embossed or raised or whatever you say it, because on the inside you see the little face indent there. So this is very nice. You can uh, um, put your cookies in there. You can. Um, coloring pencils in there. And you can put your washi tape in there. It's a very handy storage tape. So yes, I am definitely keeping that one. Hand wash only, not safe for oven or microwave. For ages 15 and up. Hmm. Okay. So that's the doggy storage tin. Um, and lastly is this. Let me just move this back. So I pan space. So, what's it gonna be? Um, I'm those again. <laughs> I just face it this way. I don't know. <laughs> it's very nice socks. On the thin side, though. But anyway, mm -hmm. okay. So, what's this pin gonna be? Oh, Hogwarts pin. Oh, well, that's pretty. It's obviously not part of the Hogwarts. I mean, the magical places. That's very nice. Kinda of looks a bit 3D-ish. If you look at it. Oops. <laughs> See, look at that. That looks very nice. And Ravenclaw has a raven, not an eagle. But anyway. The snake one looks really cool. The lion is cool as well. That does look a bit cut off at the jaw. <laughs> the badgers and the ravens have bigger sections. So I guess it would have been more, I don't know, equal if they all had kind of like the same amount of space for them. But anyway, it's very nice. I like that actually. So that's that's it for this. So there's one, two, three, four, five items. And the Quidditch t-shirt definitely going on my eBay. I'll be keeping the other four, I believe. I mean I can never do with enough socks, really, can you? Um so yes. Now which one was your favorite? 
Uh, for me, maybe for the pin, obviously. And then, I think this is pretty cute. It's a cute hobby. Looks a bit sad though, doesn't he? Or is it... Would you say it's sad? Or shy? Anyway. Thank you for watching. Like I said, more. Really do for notifications. Over and out.